for part three of Abyss Tech video logs. So, taking a look at the Dell Workstation T3400, looking at the BIOS. The service tag is the 9WDWCTH1 BIOS update was released version 8, version 8.08, whatever you want to go for. It was recently released in August 14th of 2008. Processor info is the Intel Core 2 Quad Q6, Q6600 run at 2.4 gigahertz with a 1066 megahertz front side bus, 8 megabytes of L2 cache. The family is 06, model is 0F, and has to be stepping. Microcode version is 60B6, quad core capable, and 64 bit capable. Memory info, we have 4 gigs of DDR2 run at 800 megahertz and dual channel. PCI info, date and time, which is correct. Boot sequence right here. So the drives, we have a total of 6 SATA ports. I'm going to go ahead and enable smart operations so I know what could be going on. So and, and we got integrated neck. Go ahead and set that for on because I don't have pixie boot. Integrated audio, we'll leave that for auto. USB controller on. Rear quad USB on. Real dual USB on and all that. Video, just got all that. Performance, we got multi core CPU. Speed step, I probably won't bother enabling that. Virtualization, I probably would want to put on because I probably will do that. Limit CPU value, which is used to maximum the standard Cupid function that it will support. Then we got hard drive acoustic mode, which I usually like to put for performance. Security, you got admin, SATA, password intrusion, TPM security, CompuTrace, I will leave that deactivated. Power management, have AC recovery, auto power on, auto power time, low power mode. Remote wake up. I could probably uh, do something about that. Go ahead and enable that. Suspend mode. Maintenance service tag. ASF mode. Sir message event log. Let's see what's in the event log. All right. So by the looks of it, the log was cleared back in December 9th of 2008, then went out of range. So basically, um, try to see intrusion or power on and all that. So fastboot was enabled, numlock key enabled, OS install. All right, so basically that basically wraps it up for the system right now. I wonder what, um, I wonder what operating system they put on it. As if they even bothered putting one on. Yeah, what do you know? There it goes. Let's see what operating system they put on it. Nah, I'll just leave that be. Floppy disk at seek failure. Nah, well, I probably should uh, get Windows on this thing. So, anyway. Now we'll go ahead and pause the recording. Alright, so I am back after fighting with a couple of flash drives to get Windows Server 2008. So, we are now here at the uh, standard setup for the size of hard drive and all that. So, but seeing as I have multiple hard drives, I would like to partition this one, so I'm just going to put like about... 41,000 megabytes, which will give me just over uh, 40 gigs. So let's go ahead and click on OK. So I'll make the uh, needed partitions like for the system reserve. And then I will use a uh, partition manager to um, get the Dell Diagnostics software on here, which will come in great handy, which I should probably install on my PF Sense box on the uh, Dimension 3100. Just gotta wait for it here for a minute or two. Because, you know, it's gotta write all the uh, data. So I will be right back. 
All right, so I finally got the uh, hard drive to partition. So after all the uh, partition and I need, got 192 left, which I will from a little later. So let's go ahead and, and install Windows. So this will take a few minutes at least. So I'll go ahead and pause once again. All right, so the Windows Server 2008 R2 standard has finished installing. So I am going to go ahead and set my new password, which I'm not going to tell you. There we go. My password has been changed, and let's go ahead and log in. Go ahead and unplug my flash drive, because, you know, I probably won't need that. Here we are. We made it. I got a kind of power shell here. So I got my network connectivity. Don't have an audio ser service running. Here we are. Core 2 Quad Q6600. 4 gigs of RAM. Windows is activated. Other than that, it works nicely. Anyways, this has been the three part video log of the Dell Precision 3400. Don't forget to rate this video if you liked it, give it a thumbs up. If you disliked it, give it a thumbs down. Don't forget to subscribe and follow us on Twitter, Tumblr, and Facebook, and also the website at www.abysstech.us Have a good night, people.